I've divided my talk into six broad headings. First, we'll discuss the spiritual rights of the women in Islam. There is a very common misconception, especially amongst the Westerners, that in Islam, paradise is only meant for the men, only for the males. This misconception can be easily clarified by quoting just one verse of the Quran of Surah Nisa, chapter number 4, verse number 124, where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, zakin aw unsa wa wa mu'minun fa jannata wala nakhira. That if any of you do deeds of righteousness, be it a male or a female, and has faith, he will surely enter Jannah, he will surely go to heaven, and not the least injustice shall be done to them. The same message is repeated in Surah Nahal, chapter number 16, verse number 97, where Allah says that if any of you do good deeds, be it a male or a female, and is a believer, we will surely reward him for what he has done and we will make him lead a good life. These verses are explicit and clear that going to paradise depends upon a person's faith and his righteous deeds. Iman and Amal Salihat.